guys, welcome to AKA Our 80s Life, where we're all about the 80s. And back in the 80s, I loved this little doll, Strawberry Shortcake, and all of her friends. She's so adorable, she smells great, and today I'm gonna show you my original 80s collection of Strawberry Shortcake dolls. those lucky kids whose parents saved everything. I still have most of my favorite toys from the 80s, so that is awesome. My mom even saved my strawberry shortcake lunchbox. And this is really cool. It's got the original thermos still in it. I totally treasure it. I believe I used this back in 1983 or so. And she also saved all of the dolls and accessories in this container. I have not opened this container in many years. I don't remember what all's in there, but I know I had quite a collection and I wanna show it to you today. So I had a bunch of these dolls and of course my favorite one is the original Strawberry Shortcake. She is original from the 80s. She still has her hat and her cute little green and white striped tights and her shoes and everything. I took really good care of my toys and I tried to keep all the pieces together and I'm really glad that I did. Let's see if she still smells good. Mm, not really. <laughs> she doesn't really have that strawberry scent. She doesn't smell bad. She just doesn't really have her strawberry scent. Kind of like the Cabbage Patch Kids. I wish they still smelled like baby powder, but they don't. Okay, I'm really excited to open this bin and see what's inside. So I don't remember all of the dolls' names, but I do remember this one because I think she was Strawberry Shortcake's best friend. And this is Blueberry Muffin. Look how cute. She still has her same green and white striped tights and little blue shoes. I still remember this one's name too. This is Raspberry Tart. And she is also so cute. I love her pink curly hair. I even saved the boxes from a couple of my dolls. Though so this one still has her box. And she is Orange Blossom. And you can even see the price tag here. Mom paid $7.99 at Skaggs. And Skaggs was our local grocery store. Now we can take her out of the box. She's actually been played with. I just happened to keep the box for her. So we'll take her out and look how cute she is, you guys. This is Orange Blossom. I had forgotten about this, but they actually had these little berry points on the top of the boxes and you collected these and sent them in and then Kenner, the company that made the dolls in the 80s, would send you little, you could get little prizes. I'm pretty sure I did get some prizes. I can't exactly remember what they are though. Um, but that was fun. I liked collecting all the dolls and collecting the little strawberry points. This one is still in the box and actually she has not been removed from the box or played with. So she's, her box is a little squished, but she's in great condition, original condition. And her name is Cafe Olay and she's supposed to be mocha scented. Um, and then they each had a little pet that came with them and her pet donkey is named Burrito. Isn't that the cutest thing? I love her. So for whatever reason, I left her in the box. So that's pretty awesome to still have her in the box. Now the rest of my dolls are in this doll holder that looks like a big giant strawberry. I love it. So let's open the doll holder and see who's inside. Whoa. <laughs> oh my goodness. A treasure trove of dolls. We'll have to see if I can remember all their names. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to look up some of their names. But I do remember this one. It's Huckleberry Pie. So cute. Uh-oh, Huckleberry's missing a shoe, but it's probably in here. <laughs> I also remember this one and I really liked her. This is Apple Blossom. And she has a little turtle pet. This is Apricot. Look at her adorable little hat. And she has a pet bunny named Hopsalot. 
Okay, I'm going to admit I had to look up the name of this doll. I couldn't remember her name. She is Lime Chiffon and she has a little parrot pet called Parfait. Oh my goodness, I had forgotten about these. They actually had baby twins and their names are Lem and Ada. Here's another super cute baby. This is Butter Cookie. Look at her little hat. So cute. I like her freckles too. Look at that. Okay, we have to talk about the villains in Strawberry Shortcake Land. This is Purple Pie Man. This is Captain Cackle, the berry bird. And doesn't he just look conniving? Like he's up to no good. And here comes the evil Sour Grapes and her snake Dregs, who can go around her neck like this. Oh my goodness. She looks diabolical. Like she is really super evil. And <laughs> I remember this one because I wanted her when she first came out in 1982. My friend Jennifer and I really wanted this doll. It was hard to get. Our mom searched all over and then they got on like a waiting list or something at Kmart and they got a phone call that Sour Grapes dolls came in. They had to drive across town to get them. And so this one was uh, sought after for whatever reason, but she is really cool. Look at her gloves and her awesome great dress and little boots. I mean, she is really cool. For being a bad guy, she's really cool, y'all. <laughs> I also had this little mini strawberry shortcake dollhouse that it opens like this, and then you could play with it with the little smaller characters. And here are some of those. Here's Strawberry Shortcake, Orange Blossom. I think they used to have a smell to them as well. Of course, they don't now. Well, maybe a little bit. This is the thing I was really excited to get as a kid. This is the Strawberry Shortcake Big Berry Trolley. I still have all the pieces and it's still in its original box. It's definitely been played with, so it's not gonna be perfect. But let's take a look. Oh my gosh, I did not know that was in there. Okay, bonus. Crepe Suzette, how cute. And her little dog, Eclair. Did not even realize that that was in there. How exciting. Okay, now let's see the Big Berry Trolley. Oh, there's another doll. Oh my gosh, this is a treasure trove. Oh, it's Lemon Meringue. Okay, so here is the Big Berry Trolley and it is so darn cute. I remember loving this. There's a place where you could put your little tickets inside for the trolley and, and it has on here the destination where it's gonna go. Big Apple City, or you can turn it. Lilac Park or the berry market. It even has a little bell. Here's the strawberry shortcake berry cycle. She can ride on there, so cute. And check out this little merry-go-round. I think they call it a berry-go-round probably. <laughs> I don't remember, but look at this. You push this and the girls can go for a ride. Whee! They go pretty fast actually. Hang on guys. It comes with little seat belts, so you can strap your dolls in. She's like, ooh, I'm dizzy. And this is the snail cart. This is Escargo the snail. And he pulls this little cart here. But what's really cute is when you reach your destination, you can turn this over and it becomes a little picnic table. And inside the big strawberry, there is an ice cream party. So you dump those out, put the ice cream scoops on there, and then there's these cute little leaf plates and some little ice cream scoops that go on the plates and even these little spoons. Put those on there and you have an instant ice cream party. Bye guys, see you next time.